Hey guys, it's Merrick. Um, I'm just making a quick update about starting testosterone. Um, after a really, really complicated process, <laughs> um, I finally started uh, Androdome last Thursday. Um, so today is day five, four, five, something like that. Um, so yeah. Um, I don't really know much to say. Mind you, it's, I'm kind of sleep deprived. <laughs> um, yeah, so in about 10 minutes I get to go and slather my shoulders and stomach with um, the androgel because I've already showered it to take off yesterday's um, I don't know, the word, uh, just kind of dose. There we go. It's a better term. Um, so, yeah, not much to report considering I'm only on day four or five, um, but since I haven't done like a day one or whatever starting video, um, I've, I have noticed a difference, um, I feel a lot happier and calmer, um, like, it's hard to describe. Um, I kind of have sad seasonal seasonal alternative uh, dysfunction disorder, something like that. Um, so basically, in this winter, I get really, really depressed um, because just the lack of outdoors and sun and the cold. Oh my God, the cold! I hate the cold. <laughs> um, yeah, I. Uh, just get really depressed and don't want to do anything. Well, I live in Canada, so ten months of the year we have winter. So not really. It's definitely an exaggeration. It's more like six. Anyway, <laughs> um, I definitely feel like I do when it's summertime. Now that I've been on testosterone, um, so that's pretty cool. Mind you, we've been having really bizarre weather, and especially for January. We've achieved like plus five or seven degrees Celsius, which is, well, not really unheard of, but it's definitely a change. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just feeling really good about myself. Um, just calm, I guess. Um, yeah. Um, only other thing I can really report is my dreams. They've been really messed up. Um, not in like a weird way or like a scary, creepy way, which my dreams normally are. Um, I find that my dreams have been more environmentally focused. I generally dream about people in my life. Um, and like kind of notice the details around me secondhandly. Uh, whereas now it's like a complete like whoosh, you need to notice this and this and this. Like last night. Um I dreamt that like I don't know, it was very Tolkien-esque dream with like giant trees and lakes and black Hits of doom, kind of. <laughs> but it wasn't really a doomful dream, it was more of a, oh hey, check out this imaginary environment I've created for you. And I did. Um, like, there were people, because my dreams always have people on them, but um, I didn't really care much about them. I know there's like one guy and one girl that talked to me, but I have no idea what they said. And usually I like take into account of what going on with the people and not so much the environment which um I find interesting because I guess it shows how possibly estrogen affects me but I don't know um yeah I've never really heard anyone talk about their dreams while on testosterone so if anyone's interested in the matter I've posted about it and um, 
Yeah, I think people should talk about those interesting things more. Anyway, um, I'm going to go and post this now and do my dose. Peace, yo.